Well, the adventure of the kidney stone is still running rampant. So let me give a quick summary. I got an MRI because I thought my UTI turned into a kidney infection, but no, it actually turned into the most intense pain that I've ever felt in my whole entire life, which sent me to the ER to have tests done, only to find out that it was a kidney stone. After over a week of painful episodes, I visited a urologist and got an x-ray to find out that my kidney stone had just passed. Although I am feeling quite a bit better, I have not passed it yet. The last couple days have been very, very intense, but I'm on some medication that is helping a lot. But enough about me. We have something very big going on today. Today is a new ultrasound and we get to see our sweet little baby girl. I'm so excited. Oh, Ellie doesn't know that I'm vlogging. I'm vlogging and I'm telling him that we're excited to see our baby girl while you're in the shower. This is like so fun that we get to see our baby and know that it's a girl. Like, oh my gosh, it's so fun. I can't wait. So let's get ready, let's go see our baby. I feel like we haven't shown the house very much. Maybe we have, but I just feel like we haven't. I'm in love, 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 love with our shower. And we did just get, oh Tommy, you're gonna eat all my candy. Um, we did just get a light installed, which I love that. But we're getting ready for our doctor's appointment and I put on three different outfits and this happens every morning. I get dressed and then I get upset and I throw them on the ground. But what I usually wear day to day is some leggings, like Lululemon leggings. They are stretchy, they're not restrictive. And I always wear one of Jared's shirts. They are so comfy. I always wear one of his shirts, but then I also feel frumpy. I really do. I feel like I'm not like put together and then it makes me not want to do my hair or my makeup and I just, it kind of is this cycle. I am a person that really likes to get up and get ready even if I don't have much to do because it just makes me feel better. So I have no maternity clothes and I've had several people really think that that's the weirdest thing ever um, in my comments on Instagram because I have three other kids but Tommy is four years old. So the last time I was pregnant, was a long time ago and I believe I gave quite a few of my clothes to my sister-in-law and I donated the rest and my even if I had those clothes probably the dresses and shirts would fit but the pants would not my pants are about three sizes larger than what I was when I was pregnant I've been able to keep my weight on since I've had Tommy which I'm really grateful for but I have a pile right here of clothes that do not fit. Even if I wasn't pregnant, I never wore them, so I'm kind of starting a pile of, I'm gonna get rid of these. You feel frumpy, you say? I look like a pumpkin today, look you, at me! You look like fall, you look so handsome. I look like a pumpkin, I put the shirt on and I was like, hey, I really like this, and I was like, oh, I'm wearing green pants. I'm a pumpkin. I think you look really great. Thank you. Yes, Tom? Um, so this week, I, I really yeah. want to do a alone date by myself in Vegas. It's about an hour and a half away and I just want to go eat lunch by myself, shop. I haven't bought anything for baby yet so it would be really fun for me to go do that. <laughs> you, yes, you deserve it. You I should want have to do that, that time to yourself. I, I do want to do that, but we have lots of things we need to do around the house. Um, but guys, let's go see baby girl. Last time he didn't give me a picture of the ultrasound, so I'm going to remind him to do that because I want to see her on my fridge every day. And we're also going to see what her new due date is because every time it changes. <laughs> every day it changes. I literally cannot believe we don't know this. Like we don't know exactly how far along Ellie is. Like she's like, so you're 18 weeks. I'm like, that would be great. But I think she's actually 17 weeks, but this is the first baby where we're like, I don't, don't know. know the date. Like, oh yeah, Ellie's week, 17 weeks, four days. <laughs> you know, we don't know. Yeah. Um, I just know I'm going to deliver sometime in January, and that's really all that matters. <laughs> I would love it if I was 18 weeks. I'd feel so far along. Yeah. Was. I mean, that's like almost like halfway. Yeah. So, um, they weighed me today, and I was telling Jared I feel really good because, you know, I think as a health, like a healthy weight, um, roughly that the doctors want you to gain is like 40, 45 pounds. Uh -huh. And I started the pregnancy about 15 <laughs> 16 pounds um, heavier than I have the other pregnancies. Uh -huh. So I like, I feel like I feel good because of that. I don't know the point of even saying this, just the fact that- You feel healthy. Yeah, I feel good. I think it's, it's good that I've 
been able to keep yeah, that maintain on. some weight. That's yeah, that's really great, Ellie. So I'm, I am a little nervous <laughs> for the next half <laughs> of the pregnancy. Are we gonna confirm yeah, it's yeah, a girl? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, we've right. already confirmed. <laughs> I double confirmed. Right. Already, so. I just want to see that cute face. I know. See how much she's grown. Oh, you're upside down. What's the deal? Uh oh. Oh my hell. Look at that. That's amazing. Doing flips and tricks already. Okay, well, I'm gonna try to get that femur. I'm just kind of do my measurement on that size. Mom well, had some power breakfast or something. I did last time I didn't. And so today I'm like, I'm gonna eat lots. <laughs> so she didn't turn, I just flipped the... Uh, okay. She's so bent, you can see her spine just yeah. curved. She's so bent and it's oh. like, it seems so uncomfortable. <laughs> Is it, do you think? No. Oh, okay. Because oh, I'm like, oh my gosh. Be so look, I mean, her knee's right next to her. <laughs> I head. know. It's a big kink in my neck just looking at it. Look at that leg right there. That's amazing. That's a big leg. See that? You see the pulse? Is that the cord? The yeah. cord yeah. Wow. And then uh, yeah. it's not going to be the big outstretched sea baby because she's curving around. That is a kind of see a little bit of a profile there. Yeah. yeah. I mean, those feet are above the head. Yeah. They're right next. Yeah, they are. That... You can see both feet. Yeah. Oh my like gosh. Girl. That is wild. I've, we've never her had knee. an ultrasound like that before. Her knee is, is right there. So we said 18 two. Yeah. And remember, they're not always exactly yeah. right. Uh, they just have to be close, like within a week is usually. So this is 17, so I'm going to recheck that. Hmm. How good were our dates early on? Um, you know, I think... Did I change them at all? Or did I say you were, were you measuring a little less the whole time? We came in and we said it was a date and then it was like a week behind that. So actually. that makes sense then, huh? Yeah. You've been trailing a week? Something like that. Does that yeah, sound I, right? Yeah, I think the 17 sounds accurate, not 18. Hey, sister. It's earthquake time. <laughs> and that's like... Is it the baby's heart? Do you hear it, Tom? Yeah. Does it sound good? Yeah. It's <laughs> You ready to play? Tommy, look at the screen. This is your sister. I can't see the bones. Yeah, the bones are the really white part. She's moving her legs. She's sure, moving her legs. Cute. Oh, look at that movement. So you kind of see the faint eye right here. Sorry, it's not the best face shot. She's stubborn, like her mom. Let me see. Is that true? No. I'm, not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a very easy going. Look at the hand. Yeah. Right above it. That's cute. It's like a, hey. So are you feeling some of these movements? Cause yeah. Yeah, so I was going to say, people with a placenta in the back and someone that's had a couple of kids usually tends to feel sooner. Mm -hmm. Yep, I'll feel her at night. It's pretty wild that you can feel the baby. Yeah, really yeah. faint, but that's there. Okay, so heart rate with 140s, okay. measuring 17.2, which is about a week less. And then we'll see you back, I guess, in a month. Look at her. Whoa. Is she goofy? Her feet are above her stinking head. <laughs> She's already doing flips. Yeah. She's kind of like you on the trampoline, huh? Yeah. She's a goofy baby. Yeah, he's trying to do backflip. I don't. Belly. I don't like that. <laughs> yeah, he's trying to do backflip. She is. In his belly. Yeah. She is. Is she so goofy? Yeah, he's doing the backflip in your belly. She is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what a goofy baby. <laughs> Let's see your pictures. Literally, oh my gosh. <laughs> she's like tucked. <laughs> She's going to be a gymnast. I have not even met her yet and I am so in love. I could not and still cannot stop smiling. I love seeing her. Her goofy little thumbs down and her know, feet right? literally above her head. That was so fun. She's like you when you were like a little hyena like jumping up Literally there. I cannot get enough and I'm sad I have to wait another month to see her. I love our doctor. Mm -hmm. He's really great. So, so happy for him um, because I loved our doctor when we were in Logan. I've loved all of our doctors that have delivered our babies, I honestly. I feel like we've been really lucky with our OBs. Mm -hmm. Like, they've been really sweet and sincere yeah. and kind and just 
they're born for the job. Yeah, they are. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm really grateful. He is, he has stopped taking on new, like, because he's like a family doctor as well. So, like, he stopped taking on new patients. But if you're pregnant, you can get on. And then now he will be our family doctor. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a little loophole. I jumped the system <laughs> by getting pregnant. Um, no, I seriously just feel so happy and so grateful. And now I'm extra excited. I cannot wait to go shopping. <laughs> <laughs> okay, goofball. Look at her go from that tiny little Glenn. like tadpole. Yeah. No feet yet. <laughs> to that. Literally, so I Marco poloed my sisters and Bonnie goes, Well, it's official. Like that's her personality. She's all like that is her personality. And I laughed so hard because that's what Jared said. He goes, and there's Ellie. <laughs> like I am a goofball and I am just so I'm so excited.